don't have a boy. Oh my god, I'm so nervous! <laughs> Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Camilla for those of you that are new here. So I just went to Sally's to pick up some things. Okay guys, so I am at Sally's right now. I'm gonna do my hair maybe today. I don't know, but since it's fall, I want to go a little bit darker and just get rid of all this like blonde. Um, we might go even darker than my roots, but we'll see. looks like pretty dark <sighs> on camera but I want to go it's not that dark oh it actually is really yeah. dark like I thought to I me if you looks... dried it or something yeah it's a little wet still because I washed it last night and like I had it in a bun it's a curl or no I had it in a braid. a braid so that's why it's very curly right now but yeah oh I'm tired God, I'm really... tired of like the this right here I just want to go all of this honestly I think the color that I got is my words so I got the Darkest Intense Brown from Sally's. It's the Ion brand and it's permanent color. So I was gonna get semi-permanent because then it can come out in like a few washes. But I was just like, whatever. So if I wanna- Permanent, permanent? Yeah. If I find the video, I'll link it on the bottom here. She shows exactly how to do it. Let me do a little haul for you guys on what I got. So I got the, obviously the color. The, the gloves were so expensive. So I only got one pair. The lady yeah. said that since I have highlights in my hair, she said that it's better for me to use this. So I put it all over my hair before. It's kind of like a primer. I don't know. And then she got this um, bottle. Bottle. It has the numbers on it. And then the 20, 20 volume developer. If you only use the this without a developer, it's not gonna process and once you wash your hair, it's, everything's just gonna come off. So this basically, the developer opens up your cuticles and it like goes in your hair and actually Does it make it light or no? Well, yeah, if you use this in like bleach just that. and like, no, I, I don't know, I don't think so. <sighs> oh my God, I'm nervous. People say that, you, or no, people bowl. my school, they would put like um, color. Vaseline, put Vaseline there. Okay. Oh my God, I'm so nervous. <laughs> <laughs> I put on a shirt that I don't care about in case I get it dirty, but I also have this from my school, so we're ready. Unmovable. Mm, no, this is where I'm gonna use everything. What? Color applicator. It's a okay. It's what I did at school. I think I'm ready. Kind of nervous. All right, so let's open this bad boy up. Okay, so she said that I should use a pre-color treatment. This helps to ensure even color results from scalp to the ends. Prior to color application, apply to clean dry hair, comb through without rinsing and proceed to hair color application. Oh, okay. So the first thing I'm gonna do is get the gloves. I have nails on, so I feel like it's gonna brick. Take off my ring so it doesn't make a hole. Oh, it smells good. Oh, my B-reel just came off. And so I'm gonna like do sections. Oh, it's like a gel. Okay. I had enough product, but I don't. 
All right, I, th I don't think that's a problem. Whatever, we're just gonna continue anyways. Let's move on to the color. Okay, I need to mix two ounces of the developer and two ounces of the color. Yeah, okay, two ounces of both. I got Vaseline and I'm just applying it like over like everywhere, my ears, like behind my, like my neck, anywhere that the color could touch because this will help it like remove easily afterwards so I'm not gonna have to like scrub my face and stuff. All right, let's do this. Okay, I don't know if I explained it, but I got the wrong thing because in school I learned about like the liquid um, toners. I don't know why, but in my head I was thinking I was doing a toner. I'm literally doing a color. So I just did a DIY thing. I don't have a bowl, I don't have a mixer. So I literally, I bought these bowls at Target the other day to like eat out of, but I bought three. I was only gonna buy two and I was like, I'm just gonna get three because it was literally 50 cents. I don't know why I got three. I could have gotten four, like, you know, even number. Anyway, I grabbed my my comb that I'm gonna use to like comb out my hair and it's gonna get color on it. So I was like, I mean, I can just wash it off. And I've just been doing that and it's working. So the video that I watched, she said that she applied it to the root first because that's where your fresh hair is. And um, like it's less porous and so it needs more time to like grasp on color. I like the corners first. I'm using the corner of, or like the edge of the comb. I'm making sure it's like in my scalp like this. Guys, I'm not, I'm not gonna be here teaching you guys because I have no idea what I'm doing. So this can be right but it can be wrong. I'm saying that as if I know what I'm doing and I'm like teaching you guys, but you guys should watch over like a professional video. I literally went to school. I went to cosmetology school, but it was mainly all online and I learned how to do color with freaking mayo and conditioner because I didn't have color at my house and I was just practicing how to apply it honestly didn't do much so i think i did one overall color or two overall colors and it was like a long time ago make sure it's very well saturated on the roots i really hope it comes out okay i don't know why i close my eyes whenever i do the back i feel like it gets me more concentrated or like i feel it i don't know I'm just gonna do this side off camera and I'll be back. Okay. okay guys, so she ran out of paint. This is all we have left and she like already like used all that. Um, and so she and I still like, have this whole chunk and it's very like, it's a lot. We used to have a key at my school and then it would literally go like this. It would trap it and then like you move it and it closes and you go, or no? You, no, you would roll it down. So what I did- But I, it like flattens it. Doesn't it have like spikes like that to like trap it? I don't know. Yeah, it does. 
But this kind of looked like Dude, I just what got I did. in this room and my hands are stained. You've been touching my hair. Barely. But guys, look at her hair. It's literally black. What the heck? I'm gonna be completely different. Wow, my hair is so dark. Can you see that? Oh my gosh! <laughs> We're just gonna wait till Hobie gets home now. I have color all over me. But it comes off, I think. Oh my god, it's not coming off. I literally got color over here. How? <gasps> no way. I'm staying in this whole freaking apartment. Okay. Bro, this is so bad. I Julio came with some gloves and more color. So let's finish this quickly. Now that I got the hang of it, I think I can do it quicker. Hey, no. Let's do it quickly this time. I think I dyed the whole bathroom in here. There's stains everywhere, all over my arm. I'm gonna scrub in the shower, but I honestly don't think it's gonna come off. And I ruined my nails because my last gloves were too small and they poked through, so. So I'm just gonna use my Olaplex to wash out the product. I'll come back whenever I'm out of the shower. What? What the heck? It is so dark, guys. I did not realize how dark it was gonna be. Okay, it doesn't look bad. So um, our friends our friends were just over and so I had to like kind of just scrunch it up so it would kind of be styled but I'm gonna try to blow dry it a little bit um, with the blow dryer brush and see how it would look like but oh, oh my god I look like a completely different person. Guys, I'm gonna have to style it later because yeah. oh, I look like I have a wig on because my hair is so big. Okay, guys, I never updated you guys after me blow drying it. I actually really like it. Um, there's some pieces like that I kind of messed up. It didn't get the color completely. You can see some of my like brown, but it's fine. I posted a reels, TikToks, and like stories and stuff about it and everybody's like wow it looks so good blah, blah blah so i'm starting to like it yesterday i was like in shock I, and i felt like i was wearing a wig so yeah i really like it I, I was gonna end up cutting it but honestly i think this length is fine just a little change like as we go maybe i'll cut it later on like some f uh, face framing pieces but for now i'm good because it was just too much to do yesterday but I curled it yesterday night and I slept on the curls so it could be like kind of wavy this morning But yeah, I hope you guys liked the video um, Don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the post notification bell to be notified when I post a new video I love you guys and I hope you guys liked coming along this Hard journey to get here because honestly I had no clue what I was doing. I literally went to cosmetology school and I didn't I guess I didn't learn anything. Okay. Bye guys mm -hmm.